or to rather two or more people are going to take turns telling a story that you've never told before, one word at a time. So it usually starts out with once upon a time. So I'm going to pretend my two hands are, uh, call this one Betty and uh, Barney. Once upon a time, there was a hand. Okay. So you and your partner are going to take turns telling a story one word at a time. Uh, you can also do it with a larger group. You could do it with four or five people. You could do it with your whole class. You can do it uh, in a room. You can do it over Zoom. You can play this game quite fair. You can play it anywhere. Um, this drama game is a game that you can play on video conferencing software or with your friends in person or with your brothers and sisters or your parents in person. It's a lot of fun. It can help you become a better storyteller. It can help you listen to your partner because you are going to be creating the story together. And, uh, and it can help you with your drama skills, skills like working with another person, uh, using your imagination, and uh, maybe physically acting, and changing the sound of your voice, perhaps. There's a lot you can do with it. You're gonna see myself and my friend Allison demonstrate this in a moment. First though, Beg your pardon. Um, I'm gonna get out. I'm gonna get you to repeat after me. There are three sections of a story: beginning, middle, and end. In the beginning, we ask, "Who am I? Where are we?" In the middle. We ask, what's the problem, man? And to get to the end, we have to answer the question, how do we solve this problem? Good repeating skills. That's awesome. So those are the four questions that you really need to answer in your story. Um, every story will be about someone, and that's the who. And they should be somewhere. Um, especially if you're younger, though, you don't need to worry quite as much about the where. But it's good to get in there. Um, at the middle of, by the middle of the story, your character, who the story is about, should have a problem. Every good story has a problem. Um, and at the end, you uh, you need to solve. You need to solve the problem. So how will you solve the problem? That is the story. We usually end with the moral of the story is, and then back and forth one word at a time, you come up with a moral that hopefully makes sense. It might not, but that's fine. So uh, without further waiting, here is my friend, the lovely and talented Miss Allison Swastesky, Uh, and we are going to demonstrate this for you guys. Awesome. Rad. All right, kiddos, this is a kid length one. Um, here we go. I'll start us off. Once. A. Uh, pawn. A. Time. There. Was. A. Princess. Who. Always. Liked. Drinking. Pop. She. Decided. To. Guzzle. All. The. Pop. In. The. Kingdom. This started a very bad energy coming from the princess. She began to pulsate, uh, vibrating faster and faster. Around the castle. Help! She screamed. Get the nurse. Cried the princess. What are you 
going after R scolded the nurse. I wanted to drink all the pop in the kingdom. You ought to behave and act like a princess should drink one thousand bottles of water now instructed the nurse glug, 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 glug. this glug, 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 glug. tastes boring <laughs> and i hate water lamented the sad princess you need more discipline and to drink more now Aggressed the nurse. Okay. Yeah. I feel better already. But Mm. I have to pee the moral of the story is water is better than pop. The end. Awesome, Alton. <laughs> that was that was great. That was a keeper. That that's we'll, we'll okay. use that. So sick, so sick, thank you. I just wanted to say, when in doubt, if you kind of mess up, that's okay. Just keep going through. It's all about making that story with the beginning, middle, and end. Mm-hmm. And it's all about working with your partner and paying attention to what they're saying. This is one of the best life skills you can learn, I think. Yeah, and sometimes your brain will be thinking, oh, the story's gonna go in this direction, but it's actually going in a different one. So it's okay if it ends up changing. Hair just got shorter. Actually, that was from about a month ago. Um, and uh, so in this story that we just told, uh, we, at the beginning of the story, we learned who the story was about. And in this case, it was about a princess. We also learned where she was, which was in her castle. Um, then we learned what her problem was very quickly, actually, which was that she drank all the pop in the kingdom. And that made her vibrate because she had such a sugar rush. Um, and then to get to the end, we had to figure out how the problem would be solved. And that was by drinking a lot of water. And, uh, we learned the moral of the story was that water is better for you than pop. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. We didn't plan this at all. And neither will you really plan it when you play this with your friends. Um, who knows where the story will go. Hopefully it makes sense. It might not always, especially at first, but, uh, I find this game is super fun to play. Uh, yeah, in person. Or on, uh, or on Google Meet or Zoom or whatever you use. Excellent. Have a great day and happy play.